everybody, welcome back. Chris Rupp here with another critical reaction video. Today I am back with Fleur Jensen and Nightwish. Now I did a video a little while back with her uh, doing Phantom of the Opera and it was the first time I had been exposed to her. I was familiar with Nightwish but I didn't know a lot about them or what she did and this was my first time seeing that. And my goodness, did the Nightwish fans come out of the woodwork to tell me everything there is to know about her and the band. So I thought, you know, uh, after several recommendations from them, I should do another one of their tracks and her songs. So this uh, Ghost Wish score is the number one thing that was suggested. So that's what we're going to take a look to right now. I have not seen this. Uh, this is live. And so I always love doing live stuff. So I'm ready to be impressed and wowed. And here we go. If you'd like to watch the video first, you can do so above and then come back to join me watching it now. Ghost Love Score, live at the Wacken Open Air 2013. Nice lights, big production value. screen to the side. Okay, yeah. You can probably synth strings. I'm guessing those are synth ooze and stuff too. We don't have an actual choir up there. That's a cool organ. I assume it's an organ. I don't know. It reminds me a little bit of Trans Siberian Orchestra. Similar style of genre. Ha, <laughs> crowd surfing, love it. Ah, there she is. Love her hair and makeup. Nice. Yeah. Her uh, look is really good for what they're doing here. Nice light show with the screen behind him. What's up, man? Doing great. Conserve away, buddy. You live your best life. Excellent control. And a placement of her tone. Flip there in the head voice. Color changes lovely. She's coming through very well, cl very clear, very well done. Good job, sound guy. Interesting, they've not. The uh, floor monitors in front of them, but I'm wondering if they're using in ears as well. Can't see. I need a close up there. See in her ear or not. You get a different sound. If you have the in ear monitors, you can really control what you're hearing and you can isolate everything around you. Uh, and you can ultimately get less hearing damage in the long run versus having uh, monitors blasting at you, just wall of sound everywhere. Uh, it can kind of feel better up there, but it's not as good in the long run to uh, use floor monitors versus in ears. I think it looks she's got something in her ear. She probably does have them too. When I was uh, with Home Free, we would often 
have the floor monitors and have our in-ears with separate mixes for both of them just to kind of get a little bit of both uh, have that option I'd be surprised if they didn't happen it's pretty standard now industry-wide <laughs> lights they have on the side impressive song just the whole score of this you know it's a musical journey versus a traditional pop song of three minutes long or something And seeing some of the fans are just into it. It's great seeing people enjoying uh, live performance. It's building. This is interesting. Yeah, this is a, quite a, a stretch of nothing much happening. But everyone in the audience is there, they're with it, they're in it. They'll probably know this whole score too. So they know it's coming. Alright, jumps come back. <laughs> it's fun seeing the lighters now, you know, it was a thing more 30, 40 years ago, more people smoked. Uh, but now it's you know, such not a thing anymore. Most people don't have lighters. You can do the cell phone thing. Ah, yes, I love it. Full synth. Diction is very good, very clear. Leather outfit, so cool. Where's it going? Now her crotch of guy lost his shirt. Yeah, it's an impressive job that she's doing. The, the musical style and the length of the song is going in so many different directions. You know, to sing it clearly, succinctly, the entire time is. There's a lot of skill involved with this. And not just the singing, to sell the image and just own the stage is a skill set that's hard to teach. You kind of either have it or you don't. Get the crowd with you, love it. More crowd servers. Security guards down there. They always be watching. Oh yes, pyro. Pyro stuff uh, in live is always impressive. It's a little bit easier to do when you're outdoors, uh, but either way, you have to have a full-on uh, pyrotechnics technician, and you have to have permits for it. And stuff. It's it's uh, tough to do. It's oftentimes not worth it. But if you're at this giant uh, festival or what is it? Whatever it is, uh, you can totally afford it then. 
And you feel that too. When I was on the sing off, one of the bands did uh, a number that had fire in the background, and just being near it on stage off of the side as they were testing it, I mean, you feel that heat. Yeah, sorry for drummer guy getting blasted behind him with it. Oh, does she have a fan blowing on her? Yes, she does. Love it. You can see the little fan down at the bottom. are in sync with what they're doing so they're probably on a metronome usually groups are using a metronome so the lights can sync with it perfectly or you could have a light guy that's just hitting it when it, uh, on the beat what's happening but it's probably they're all on a metronome uh, grid yeah there's the in-ear monitors you can see them there I love the fan on her. I don't have that same option. The fan doesn't work for me. Oh, headbang, that also doesn't work for me. <laughs> yeah, you can see they're having so much fun doing this. I like the drummer guy too, he's into it. Well done. All right, cool. Thank you, everybody, that suggested I uh, check out more of uh, Fleur and Nightwish. They are impressive. What they do both in their live show and in just physically what they're doing with their singing. Uh, not easy to do. Very well done. Cool. Hey, if you enjoyed this video and want to see more of my critical reactions, please subscribe to my channel. Click on the notification bell to always see uh, new things I have that come out. And uh, follow me on all the social media stuff. Support me on Patreon. And uh, yeah, I think I covered it all. Cool. So thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Let all mortal flesh keep silent.